sub. Sub what? Sub what the hell? What the fuck? Hey guys, it's Gator. We're on the PO server. I'm trying to change this. Ooh, my screen got a little brighter. I don't think that affects you. But yeah, we're on the PO server. I am back from my grandma's house. That's uh, for Thanksgiving. It was just me, my mom, and my grandma. Good times. That's why I wasn't uploading anything. Hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving too. I kind of talk a little fast there. I I am not for talking fast. I'm going to slow it down. I'm going to slow it down a little bit. So hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving. If you don't celebrate Thanksgiving, I hope you're still having a good time right now. Hope you're enjoying your life and where you're heading to or whatever you're doing with your life. Hope you're happy. Enough of me hoping. Let's do some battling. Were you actually using a rain team this time? Why? Just because first I was going to make a team with Thunderous T because I haven't seen rain offense in a while. And I was like, fuck it. I suck with rain and I especially suck with rain offense. I can't use it. It's nearly impossible for me. I don't understand why. But it's very hard for me to use Rain in general. I just don't like the whole idea of Politoed. I just don't think it's that good of a Pokemon. It can't really do too much. It just sits there and scalds. Well, that's what all I see it doing. It's sitting there and scalds. Yeah, sure, it has Parasong, which is pretty neat. And Encore, which is also pretty good. But I like Tyranitar better for Pursuit. It has uh, access to Stealth Rock. It has very well-rounded stats. And I like Ninetales because it can switch. It can switch it's a good it's not a bad pivot switch when you think about it like it can switch into some water attacks relatively easily which is very good it has access to um will wisp which i think is better than toxic in almost all almost all cases and it's just, you know the ability just a sunny day i mean you don't want to see polyto and rain dance it kind of needs different moves that's why I like i don't like polyto that much but we're using it scald ice beam encore parasong refuse to use protect because i don't want to feel safe i'm not that great with uh using protect but I do have protect on tentacruel because you kind of need it for the rain dish health uh, I don't know if I explained what the whole I'm pretty sure I said it the whole idea behind the team is sub Zapdos, toxic spike tentacruel it's a pretty simple idea uh, we have choice scarf Jirachi mainly because Deoxys D if I see it as a lead I kind of just lead with this and trick it so it can only get up stealth rock um, this weird Gliscor, I'm actually going to change this now. I'm actually going to use the Toxic set. Just, but I'm not going to use Protect. I'm not going to do that. I don't like doing that. But I am going to use Taunt Toxic, which might sound weird. But uh, I played with the team a little bit earlier. And there's too many fucking Levitators and Flying types. And I, I need to Toxic them if I want to do this with Zapdos. Uh, and then we have Life Orb Mammoth Swine just for sheer power. And I needed a Stealth Rocker. This is a pretty good Stealth Rocker for this team. So I think I have to save the team again. Save team. Mammo? What the hell? No, don't go there. Don't. don't okay, thank you. Mammo. Zap. Yeah. And yeah. It's pretty funny because the team I had before this, I think it'll be. Look, I have a regular ass Rotom. You know why? Because I was playing with it earlier, and five games in a row, I got met with a fucking Thunder. Uh, not Thunderous, a Landorus. And it gets shit on me. I'm t it's too powerful. So I put in a Rotom. I was just that pissed off by it. I had to put in Rotom. Just regular ass Rotom. We're not using that. That team is just bad. We're using this one. Which is still bad. No, I don't know if it's necessarily bad. But I suck with it. I can't use Rain. But I'm using it just because I want to. I haven't used Rain in a long time. And I think Zapdos is pr an underrated Pokemon in general. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if you noticed, but I did not have HP Ice on my Zapdos. I had HP Grass because I don't have nothing to kill Gastrodon with. So, did this change? Awesome. All right, so we're good to go here. Uh, Conqueror is a problem, but he doesn't have any weather, so we'll just lead off the Politoed. As he, he leads off Heatran, I'm guessing he's gonna get up Stealth Rock. I don't know. Heatran's a great Pokemon. It takes a lot of hits, except Earthquake, of course, but. It can take some hits, man. Uh, he doesn't have a good switch in. Okay, yeah, it took that, like, no no business. It seriously just took that hit without a problem. I'm gonna go into Gliscor just because he might... Yeah, do that. <laughs> Try to take advantage of the situation here. If he substitute, I'm out of here. Alright, so I gotta... But he is fucking... He is that set. He just happens to be that, that great set that we all hate 
well it's, it's a good set when you're using it but I hate it when I see it ooh don't burn that ah uh, shit all I just do is make one ice punch and I lose and he did not ice punch thankfully so I'm gonna sub up or at least try to and it's not working out too well so uh, I'm gonna sub up again <laughs> I have nothing to take a hit from this I told you this is a big threat sure I have a tentacle but I'm gonna take pretty hefty damage I think let me see here 28 okay never mind that's not as bad as I thought I think Scald will kill him at this range so we'll just go for a safe Scald not gonna set up toxic spikes if you look at his team nothing's affected by it so that kinda sucks that nothing on the team is affected by toxic spikes but oh well I guess it's kinda weird though uh... shit I'm gonna go into Jirachi just cause I'm Scarf and I'm gonna Iron Head to break its scale I don't care if I get the flinch that did absolutely nothing especially since I don't have any investment and I crit him that's cool but I don't have any investment in HP or anything oh yeah the rain's up duh uh, he trans back can't touch my Gliscor unless it has HP ice yeah he has toxic so he can't touch me I'm gonna go for a sub I don't think he can break my sub with anything yeah and yeah, we'll kill him off earth wait and the rest of his Pokemon are pretty much, uh, oh, this is kind of a big threat, I guess. Um, I'm pretty sure Zapdos is gonna get, shit, don't want to bring in Jirachi, cause I need Jirachi alive, cause just the fact that it's Scarf, so I'm just gonna let Zapdos die, cause I don't need this. Cause all his Pokemon outspeed me anyway. Well, I think they outspeed, I'm gonna assume that they outspeed me. Cause I've come across some crazy stupid shit. They have not fucking Pokemon that... Like, what the... I faced someone... He had Latios. Zapdos fucking outsped it. He had a... What else did he have? He had a... Well, Salamis speed ties, I guess. But he had some weird shit. He had Terrakion. My, my, every, all his Pokemon were slow. I was like, why? Why are they all so slow? That just didn't make any sense. I didn't understand what was going on. Alright. Somehow, I'm one with Rain. Even though, like, my whole strategy was ruined from the get-go. Because he only had one Pokemon affected by Toxic Spikes. And it was burned. That was great. And now I'm facing big fucking threat team. What the hell? This is like standard fucking threat team. I can't deal with this. Like, I have to use this if I want to beat him. Um, Scarf Jirachi can get to him a tiny bit. Which is nice, I guess. And the fact, this is another reason why I like Tyranitar. It's slower than the rest of the weather inducers, I think. Maybe it's not as slow as a bomb, so I don't know how fast that is. But it's slower than the rest, which is good. Please flinch yourself. I don't want you hitting me. Awesome. Um, what does he have to take this? He has a Keldeo, but anything's going to take decent damage, like maybe 17. That, that took some decent damage. That's respectable. Uh, his attack rose. I'm assuming he's going to U-turn out. Flamethrower won't kill me, so I'm going to just sit here and click Iron Head. I don't have a problem with this. Especially since I have a 60% chance to flinch him on top of that. Yeah. He has to go into Keldeo, I'm assuming. And this is a good chance to get in this. And Toxic Spikes do hurt his Tyranitar and his Keldeo er, and Terrakion. So it hurts a couple things, so I'm going to go ahead and go for that. Uh, my only Pokemon to take a hit from this is Jirachi, so that's this is not going to end up well. I am just going to go for the Skull to see what he wants to go for. And he did go for Hidden Power. I'm assuming he's um, fucking just standard Psy Shock, Hidden Power Fire. But if he doesn't have Hidden Power, I mean Psy Shock, which he does, he just revealed it. I'm just going to have to let this die though. Like, I don't want to uh, risk getting shit on. Yeah, I'm just going to let this die. Okay, I got up one layer, and one layer is good. One layer might actually be better against this team than two. I never thought one layer was better until Chimpact mentioned it. So thank you, Chimpact. Uh, now is actually a decent time to go into this. It looks like. Or we can go back into Jirachi. But Jirachi can come in at any time. This can't. might not get too many opportunities to come in. And this isn't a bad opportunity to get in here. 
And look at that. Zapdos outspeeds them. Oh no, Genesect has base 99. That's right. Well, thank you for not being Scarf. I don't outspeed this. I'm gonna sub up. Oh, right. So he's Draco, Psyshock, HP Fire. Doesn't have Surf. That's gonna be good to know. It does not have Surf. I'm just gonna keep subbing up. Uh, I think my Polito is special defensive, so it's not gonna be the greatest against his Latios. And it sucks that I don't have HP Ice. So yeah, we're just gonna sit here. I'll roost up now. Because he's taking some decent damage. And yeah, see, that was okay. I took that okay. That wasn't too bad. But now I can go into Jirachi pretty easily. And try to spam more iron heads on him. Because he does not have whatchamacallit. What do you call it again? Surf! But actually, because he does have Keldeo and the rain is up and my tentacle is dead, I want to go for Thunder Punch, no matter what he brings in. I think it's a good play. That was, see, that was a good play. Because even if he goes, if he, if he switches into Landers, I have things to take it. So it's not going to be like the end of the world. Okay. I thought Zapdos does not... I thought it was especially defensive Zap... I thought I had enough HP investment to not get to a KO by that. That was a fucking joke. I just got shit on by that. Well, that's great. Um, but I think we can pretty much win with what you call it for the most part. What do you, what do you call his name? Oh, that was great. HP Grass actually worked out. Jirachi. That's what it's called. Jirachi can do a lot of work against him. Especially since he just went for Draco. I can bring this in to spam the fuck out of Iron Head. I don't have anything else to worry about. I don't think so. He can't kill him. I don't know why he's staying in. Like, his last hope... Is he going to leave his last hope to Landers, even though I have a Mammoth Swine? I think Terrakion's low enough to where Ice Shard kills it. Oh, he sacked that. Okay. Well, I don't care about the weather anymore. Well, I kind of do. Hold on, what died? This died. No, this died. I'm worried about him subbing up. No, I'm not, because I have priority in Mammoth Swine. So I'm gonna let Politoed die. And I'm gonna go into Mammoth Swine. I can kill pretty much anything. I think. Yeah, like he's just gonna leave this in to die. But I think Latios dies. Yeah, everything dies. I think it dies, right? This is Adamant, yeah. So, we kill big threats, guys. We kill big threats around here with Mammoth Swine. <sighs> Who's next? I'm ready. What are they talking about here in the main chat? Haxorus or Latios? Or Let's just talk about all the dragons. Broken as fuck. Kyrium B? Come on, dude. That is way too fucking powerful. Look, he has a Gastrodon. But he has a Flygon. <laughs> what? Uh... Mammoth Swine is great against this team. I have to recognize that, right? I'm just gonna lead off with it. This is great against like all this team. I'm gonna go for a safe earth. Did not die. Adam and Life Orb did not die. Kinda disappointed. I'm gonna go for a safe ice school crash. Because it hit Zatu. And that. Forgot about that thing. But that was safe play. Could would have killed Tyranitar either way. But I think Icicle Crash has a chance to miss, doesn't it? Yeah, so that, I guess that wasn't the safest play. Uh, this is a problem, because if he has Toxic and he Toxics my Zapdos, I lose. If he Toxics my Polito, that's fine. I guess. No, it's not. I need Toxic Spikes up. I don't think he's going to give me that opportunity. We'll see. Oh, he just scalded. it. Uh, I can Rapid Spin safe. Yeah, I didn't take too much from that, so that's good. I'm going to switch into Zapdos. And try to substitute... And he's not suspecting HP Grass, which is great, because I can get big damage off. Don't burn me. I think he might burn me. Okay, he didn't. Good. And your, what's this called, is a low enough amount of HP to where it'll die. Not that. I was talking about your Tyranitar. But okay. Um, Landers can come in. So. Okay. I guess that worked out. I didn't want Zot to do anything. So, I guess that was a safe play. I'm going to Polytoad now. I forgot I'm specially defensive. That did a lot. Holy shit. 
I'm going to my Gliscor, please. Help me. This is good. This is pretty good right here. Especially since he does he went for fire punch. That's weird. Um fire blast I think is better. Don't sub in my face. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. For not substituting in my fucking face. Now I think yeah, once again I think we win Mammoth Swan. I'm gonna go for Ice Beam because I think it'll KO or two KO Gastrodon. Psychic? What? Okay, now it's not gonna 2 kill your Gastrodon though. But I can encore you. No, I'm f shit. I forgot Gastrodon's slow as hell. But I can still encore him. No, you don't want to get encored. Okay. Uh, what the hell? You're trying to win with uh, your Sand Slash. All I need, if, I just need the Toxic. The Toxic's too important on this thing. <laughs> yeah, that's just too important. I had to get that off. And I'll taunt him. So he can't do anything. I should still be able to win. Yeah, I still won. I'm pretty sure. Oh, we'll just wear it down a little bit. He switched. Again. I'm roost up. He might just stone edge thinking he's faster. That still broke my... That's powerful. Good God. I can stall out his stone edges. He should be out. At any time. Yeah, you're gonna run out right now. Which is great. There it is. All out. And I win. I don't think I need to do that. I don't think I had to stall him out. I didn't think HP Grass would have killed. Oh, and um, there will after this PO live, there'll probably be a Duel on Network live uploaded later this day. Speaking of Duel on Network, I like how his name's Luster Dragon when I start talking about that. And he's fucking carrying Black and Deoxy. Okay. But yeah, th those two things are going to happen, and um, starting Monday is going to be Walking Dead week, so all that week is just going to be Walking Dead episode 5 for the whole week. So this will probably be the last people alive until like next weekend. Don't be mad at me, I like Walking Dead, and I'm like, I like to mass upload it. Well I, well, I just started doing it on episode 4, and that went out, turned out pretty well. So I kind of want to do the same thing for episode 5. Uh, I kind of don't, I have to trick, just because he has Magnazone. But... No, Carrion B is not as fast as Jirachi anyway. He went for Magic Coat. I think he actually gets to use a move now. <laughs> I'm not 100%. I think he actually gets to use a different move. Oh, he just switched. Gliscord. Try to activate my Toxic Orb at least. That's good. And we can sub up. Unless you have a. Sh okay. I can't touch him. That's not good. That's why I don't like Toxic, because I can't touch this. I'm going to go into Tentacruel, just because I can... Oh, he's light. He might have Thunderbolt. But I don't want him taking advantage of me protecting, so we'll just find out the hard way. He doesn't. Okay. I thought Scott, I thought Gengar was frail as fuck. How is he alive? I am going to protect her, just because I know he's going to Shadow Ball again. Um, But how is Gengar alive? Just curious. I thought I thought Gengar was super frail. Not frail enough for a tentacle. If Deoxys D comes in, I don't understand what he's gonna do. If Karen B comes in, that's retarded. Cause that thing's too powerful. I'm gonna save my tentacle if that thing comes in. Just because I'm pretty sure Deox is gonna lock himself into something dumb. Alright, hopefully he might just click Outrage. Sub. Sub what? Sub what the hell? What the fuck is this? Sub Fusion Bolt Out- I don't understand what this does. I have no idea what Carrion B set this is. I've never seen this. Okay, well it can't touch me, so that's good. Um, I'm gonna go to Mammoth Swine. Just cause he has the Magazone. And this looks like a decent switch. If he's no, if he subs again, I'm fucked. I'm just gonna iron hit. That this is. I'll sit in here all day. Let's let's just chill here. We can chill here for the time being. Oh, not that long. You can get the chiller there for as long as I wanted to. But this hurts your team a lot, which is good. Stealth rock. 
I'm gonna stealth rock just because it'll hurt. I don't think you can switch into anything besides the Oxus. Unless you go into Ditto, which would piss me off because you would just die. Okay. This is great. This is actually really I'm in a nice position right here. I kind of don't even want to rapid spin. I want to get up the layer of toxic spikes. I'm going to try that. That worked out well. I think this is choice in some way. Because, I mean, why wouldn't it be? He would have subbed up, or at least tried to on my Jirachi, I think. And he might go for something stupid, but I don't, I'm pretty sure Protect's obvious, but I kind of want the HP at the same time, so this is a, a decent time to Protect. Because he doesn't really have a good switch into this besides that Curium gay shit, but the layer of Toxic Spike and the Stealth Rock will help a lot. So, I'm not too worried about that right now. I don't know what he's thinking of. Come on, Luster Dragon. Luster Dragon's a powerful, powerful, very powerful Yu-Gi-Oh card. Just kidding, it's weak as fuck, but whatever. Uh, yeah, he's here right now. Um... Huh. He's probably gonna go for substitute, I'm guessing. But he's gonna get worn down. Oh, just click outrage? I don't know if I agree with that. I'm pretty sure Zapdos is faster and I can stall you out pretty well. Or you can get three turn outrage and then on top of that, don't hit yourself. That would just be the greatest. You get three turn outrage, don't hit yourself. And then when I try to roost, you still hit. That would be nice. That would, that would just make, make the whole world go round. Once again, I'm kind of leaving my win condition up to Mammoth Wine, which isn't too good right now. Okay, I think it's going to happen. I think I'm just going to die. I might just die here, guys. Yes, thank you. Good lord. Uh, I don't know if I should sub. No, I'm not. not no, I did not want to do that. I just want to kill him. I was like a good amount of HP there. Current B. Um, I don't know what you're holding, but I have two ground types. But I still don't know what you're holding. If you're you're not scarf because um Iron Head, and I wasn't scarf when I went for Iron Head. Oh, that's funny. Zapdos getting poisoned. <laughs> that's pretty funny. So, yeah, that, that one layer of Toxic Spikes did help me. And we're probably just going to get one more. Because um, I want to start the Walking Dead stuff. Or start playing it. Before I have to go somewhere. I might not have time. I might have to wait. I don't know yet. This will be the last one. And... Machamp is threat. Not going to lie. Machamp... But... Toxic Spikes hits... Two Pokemon. Not... We might lose this one, because Machamp is threat and Toxic Spike hits two Pokemon. But we still have a good Politoed lead, so... He can set up Stealth Rocket, I think. That's a, he can Endeavor. Or just go for an attack. I keep forgetting that I'm uh, especially defensive, and I burned him, which is unfortunate. But I always forget that I'm especially defensive. Uh... I don't have Ice Fang on Gliscor, shit. Just because I'm especially defensive, I'm going to switch here. And I'm guessing... I mean, I have, I have Mammoth Mine anyway to Revenge Kill, that's why I'm not too worried about this. I'm just going to go for Toxic, I guess. Like, he can Dragon Dance all he wants. I'm just like... I was, I was actually going to go into Polytoad's Death Fodder. That's why I was trying to click Cancel. But like, yeah, he can Dragon Dance all he wants, but he's not going to kill me. I want my Gliscor alive, so... We'll just sack that. He could switch and try to bring this in later, I guess. But, yeah. Okay. Scizor is not a problem, because I have Tentacruel. Wow, I like how you actually brought that in when I was thinking about it. That- what the fuck? Your baton pass? No! Don't do that to me! He's really gonna do this to me. Jirachi? Can I burn him? No. I don't know what you're gonna... He's gonna spam Iron Head with this thing. Okay. Oh, he has Thunder Punch. Why didn't you just go for Thunder Punch? That kills. 
That was unexpected, and that definitely caught me off guard. My timer's going down and nothing's happening. That am I lagging? I might be lagging. Did I get booted offline? Cause that would kind of suck. I actually wanted to see if he could kill all my Pokemon. Ooh, can I burn him? Aw, oh, fuck. I can't burn him, and he's going to be able to kill me at this range. I think, yeah. He should, I'm pretty sure he could kill me at 100%. I have no way of killing this. I don't think Jirachi outspeeds this. No, he's at plus two. I'm only at plus one. Um, if I can just get off an attack, Ice Shard can kill him. Then I still have to worry about his... Whatchamacallit. That was good that I got that attack off. His Machamp. Which Zapdos probably had to deal with. Because that's the only thing I can think of. Of how to win. Because otherwise I'm going to lose. Uh, I don't know if I should... He had Sword Stance Agility. Um... I don't know if Ice Shard kills at this range. I'm a Life Word Mamoswine. I think it will. Good. I'm adamant too, so I guess. I'm kind of glad you brought this in. But at the same time, I don't want to... I kind of want my priority in, in Mamoswine for your Alakazam. So I'm just going to switch here. Um, I'm guessing as Ice Punch, but if I hit myself, I hit myself. It's whatever. I have nothing else to do. Yeah. So this is good. I, th I think I'm one. I'm pretty sure this kills. Yeah. And I get the priority off on his Alakazam. And Alakazam can't kill Zapdos with any one hit. So that went out well. That Jirachi looked like a huge-ass threat. I thought I was for sure going to lose to. Focus Blast. Okay. But yeah, unless, oh, I was about to say, unless he crits me, but I guess it crit didn't matter. I guess he was Sash, I'm not sure. That scissor was weird and caught me off guard. I thought Tentacruel would just come in and take whatever it had to do, but it baton passed. It was kind of weird. Interesting. And definitely, um, noteworthy. But yeah, I guess I did well with Rain. Look at that, did, did okay with Rain. Just st try to stick to your strategy of whatever your team's based around. And try to eliminate their even if you don't know the strategy i guess the most important thing is to stick to your own strategy so if you can leave a like or a comment on the video greatly appreciated thankful man thanksgiving time thankful for the like <laughs> but yeah so i guess that's about it like i said a dual network video will be uploaded later today walking dead will be uploaded all of next week i might fit in another video probably not though i don't want to upload too much it's probably gonna be like two walking dead videos a day or something and yeah, it's Gator, and I'll see you guys next time.